right now are a pleasure to be joined by the president of New York City Football Club, Brad Sims. Brad, thanks for a few moments. And I guess the first thing here in 2020, everything's been crazy with the pandemic. So I like yeah. to reflect on things that have been a constant that we can remember from years past. So in that vein, I ask you, while we're back at Yankee Stadium, albeit without the fans, can you give us an update on where New York City is in their search for their own stadium? Well, first, yeah, first, <laughs> jump right off with the heart with, with the tough questions here. But uh, thanks for having me. Great to be here, and especially great to be in Yankee Stadium. Um, we we missed it, and even though you know we we did have a positive experience at Red Bull Arena, I, I have to give credit where credit's due. You know, the Red Bulls are the rivals of ours on the pitch, but off the pitch, you know, their sense of partnership, we really appreciate that, um, and we had some success there. We were four and one in our in our five home games there, but. Nothing's like home. We're back in the South Bronx. We're back in Yankee Stadium. Uh, very important to be here, and we want to play home games here whenever it's possible for us to do so. Um, and, you know, our record at Yankee Stadium is nothing short of incredible the last few years. I don't know if everybody knows this, but we've only lost five matches here since the beginning of the 2017 season. So, like, 59 or 60 match matches, uh, we only have five losses. So, as you can imagine, our coaches, our players, very excited to be here playing at Yankee Stadium. Um, and we do miss our fans. You said you said that up front. We we definitely miss our fans. But having just being in this building and you get the sense and you and everyone knows the unbelievable atmosphere they help create. And we hope we'll have them back really soon. Getting into the new stadium, you know, throw, throwing the fastball at me right from from the get go. I think that that's something that remains a huge huge priority of the club. Something that's extremely important to us and. I know I feel the fans pain. I know how badly they want it. I know how badly they want uh, news on the confirmation of it. And I can assure all of our fans that there is no stronger sense of urgency possible than what we have right now to be able to deliver that to our fans. And we have a team that's working on it full time, 100 percent of the time. Um, and we've made a ton of progress. We really have. And we're very optimistic, as optimistic as we've ever been. Having said that, you know, it's a long process. And for us, you know, arguably the most important part of that process is the community, the community input, working with community leaders and making sure that this project is something that uh, reflects what they want and what's important for, for their community. We, you know, we feel that this is something, not just the stadium, but the overall project that we're going to be working on is something that's going to be transformational for the South Bronx. And we need to make sure that everyone is aligned with that vision. Um, but we're making progress. We're feeling good about it. And, you know, we've ne never been as optimistic as we are right now. And, and hopefully we'll have some good news to share uh, with our fans as, as, as soon as we can.